Inside linebackers Vaughn Johnson and Sam Bills were flanked by Pat Swilling and Ricky Jackson on the outside. As a group, they made 18 trips to the Pro Bowl. The most physical of the quartet was Johnson, a 6'3", 235-pounder who packed a wallop on any runner who might venture into his territory. He was quoted as saying, I like to see their eyes roll back, concerning any unfortunate ball carrier to make contact with the four-time pro bowler. His lifetime best performance came against the San Francisco 49ers, where in one game, he had 28 tackles, causing defensive coordinator Steve Sedwell to say, I don't know what he ate before that game, but I hope he eats it again. Vaughn grew up in Moorhead City, North Carolina, where baseball was most popular and where his dad was a great player. So Vaughn grew up with baseball and basketball as his first loves. Like his dad, he excelled in baseball, a strong-armed catcher and power hitter. But it didn't take long for Vaughn's hitting to transgress from baseball to the gridiron. Johnson chose North Carolina State because it was close to home and family. His game quickly rose to the next level under the tutelage of Wolfpack linebacker coach Greg Robinson, who was one of the toughest guys Vaughn ever met, very demanding and always pushing him to be the best. It was Robinson who taught Vaughn Johnson about being physical. Opponents will tell you Vaughn learned well. So did New Orleans. The hapless Saints had been the league's punching bag since their inception in 1967. The arrival of head coach Jim Borey in 1986 signaled the new beginning. The 1987 team reached a milestone with a 12-3 record and the first winning mark in team history. Johnson's fondest football memory. The turning point was in late November. A win over the Steelers stemming from a pair of magnificent goal line stands in the fourth quarter ended up being a 20-16 Saints win. It was the fifth win in a nine-game win streak of a memory-making season. Johnson spent eight seasons in a black and gold uniform from 1986 to 93, finishing his career with 669 tackles. The Dome Patrol stands as the NFL standard for linebackers. All four were selected to the 1992 Pro Bowl, the only time all four linebackers from the same team were so honored. Prior to his arrival in the Crescent City, Johnson said, the only thing I knew about New Orleans was that the fans wore bags over their head. After Vaughn Johnson's career, the bags were never needed again.